you will, and uh, we're going to simply be, um, uh, we're not going to be dissuaded. America should punish the ICC and put Kareem Khan back in his place. And if the ICC is allowed to threaten Israel's leaders, we know that America will be next. There is a reason that we've never endorsed the International Criminal Court, because it is a direct affront to our own sovereignty. We don't put any international body among, among or above uh, American sovereignty, and, and Israel does that, doesn't do that either. The announcement of the prosecutor of the ICC is beyond outrageous and shows the extent to which the international judicial system is in danger of collapse. Taken in bad faith, this one-sided move represents a unilateral political step that emboldens terrorists around the world and violates all the basic rules of the court according to the principles of international law complementarity and other legal norms. Mr. Khan creates a twisted and false moral equivalence between the leaders of Israel and the henchmen of Hamas. This is like creating a moral equivalence after September 11th between President Bush and Osama bin Laden or during World War II between FDR and Hitler. What a travesty of justice, what a disgrace. The prosecutor has absurd charges against me and Israel's defense minister are merely an attempt to deny Israel the basic right of self-defense.